Welcome to a new fucking video. Disclaimer. This video contains some fucking bad language. Like cunt. Cum guzzler. Wank stain. Runt. Dipshit. So if you are easily offended, please leave this shitty video and go back to watch my guides. So let's begin shall we? Today I shall show you what type of people fill up the grand exchange, also known as the cunt exchange. The first and probably most known are these fucking bots that keep spamming their RSGP selling sites. Why doesn't Jajix do something about these bots? Well because they introduced their own version of real world trading, bonds. <laughs> The next one up in line are the doublers. Oh here we go. You've probably seen these pricks in the G pointy telling people that they will double your juicy coins. But only in two fucking trades? Fucking logic. Anyways these dickheads will scam you when you trade your hard earned 50k. Yes they will scam you for fucking 50k coins. What's even worse are their friends. Usually they will say that the doubler doubled their pathetic 50k or 1 mil and keep repeating this as if they won the lottery. This is all a trap however, they just want to seem legit to scam your fucking 50k. Yo can you even believe this shit? There are actually people recruiting for their clans at a fucking trading center in this game. As if someone who's trying to sell their fished lobsters is interested in joining your fucking two member clan and what's even worse, in free to play they line up with vexes on the entire fucking road to the grand exchange. Next up, the fire maker. Yeah I don't even want to start to talk about these runts. All they do is throw logs on a bonfire and talk to each other as if they are family. The average fire maker looks like this in real life, like one of those Alaskan survival bricks from that TV show on Discovery. Remember how we talked about those doublers? These cunts are such an influence on the community there are actually noobs that ask if there's a doubler around to double their pathetic 50k again. Like what the actual fuck? Lol Bankston does really have nothing to do with their life, so they just sit next to a bank for no reason, probably wanking off to hente. If you remember the NSRs from my previous funny skit these guys are just as pathetic as a NSR is. By the way, if you did not notice on that screenshot, the next video in autoplay was one of Will Miss It's skits. How fucking brilliant is that? Edaters dot 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 fuck me. Is there anywhere in this game where they don't hang out and talk dirty to each other? Like holy shit can I just play this damn game for once without seeing some dude with a female character? Telling a male character that he is her daddy. This is probably worse than the accident in Chirilnabil. The rich kid. These guys aren't per se toxic. Well this one guy that did not give me a bond when I asked for one is a fucking cunt. These guys act as if 500 mil is nothing. But then if you ask for your pathetic 50k again it's like oh yo no I can't give you that gold. Because my dad fucks me too hard in the asshole every day. <laughs> The bond buyer. This stupid rat does not know where he is located at, he is obviously at the cunt exchange and can put in an offer for a bond and fucking wait, but no he needs to ask people and smash his keyboard to buy his bonds. The grand exchange by limit kid. This guy has to get his hands on some battle staves, talismans or alks. But these items have a buy limit, so what do you do? Beg everyone to buy you 100 of a fucking item, so you can alk for another minute. The beggar, similar to the G-pointy limit kid, this person keeps asking for money so that he can train his stupid account or trade the gold over to his 500 total main. These people are nothing like homeless people in real life. These guys have autism and homeless people do not. At least I think they don't. These fuckers are on a whole new scammer level. They try to make you go to their shitty 5 sub YouTube channel. Then tell you to go to the RS forums link in the description, which is in fact a fake website that looks similar to the real one. Then you fill in your account details and they will fucking clean the living shit out of your bank. And then you will probably quit the game like a little bitch. Okay so this next one is actually fucking hilarious. It's the fake drop party lad. All he does is look rich and say drop party and all these retards start following him, thinking they will get free stuff. I'll shut up. Just enjoy this one for a second. Slap on the music cancer.
What the fuck, he logged. What a bitch. Hey I hope you sick bastards enjoyed this video, because it has come to an end. Thanks to King Finesse and Junie for helping me out with a large chunk of the clips. Now fuck off.